Hello everyone! This game we're gonna be playing Trindamir in the mid lane. My right arm is a lot stronger. Uh, Trindamir is a bruiser that's extremely strong in a 1v1 and he scales really well. And plus he also split push like a madman, so <laughs> if you enjoy the split push playstyle, Trindamir is definitely the champion to play. We're gonna be playing him in the mid lane this game. It's not a big deal, I mean we can just transition to a split push uh playstyle afterwards. Early laning phase, all you're doing is just stacking your Fury, which is your red bar, underneath your health bar. Uh, the more you have, the more crit chance you have as well. So you definitely want to stack your Fury before you try for like a trade. I am your worst nightmare. Alright, let's get our Q here. And you can press your Q to uh, pretty much get the HP back. It's like a heal. Alright, we're doing a lot of good trades on him. He's probably gonna grab his fruit here. This will be a slaughter. Follow my blade. Okay. We're just gonna pop our Q to heal. Yeah, right now we're just pinning the uh, just under his power. Alright, he ended up flashing. Right, let's go back, grab the hunter fruit. We can stay in lane after this, and he will have the back. Go, oh, and we can press a Q again to heal. Bottom turret is under attack. This will be a slaughter. Looks like he back, so we can actually get some play here. Minimum is extremely good at sustaining a lane as well. Maybe you can get some trades and force your enemy to back. You can uh, definitely get some damage on their tower. And we can just constantly press Q to heal back up. Alright, he did buy his item, so we're gonna back here to get our items. And let's get the boots here. Follow my blade. We don't have any kills at the moment, but that's fine. Uh, we scale really well just by farming. Ally slain. Now they die. Into battle. Ooh, okay. Accidentally popped the ghost there. Was kind of deciding whether I want to go in a knife just because he didn't have his ulti, but. He had a too big of a wave, I guess. This will be a slaughter. Follow my play. Now they die. As you wish. We might be able to kill him there with the ignite. Oh, okay. That's not too bad, we end up trading the one for one. But the wave's gonna push back into him. Hopefully it gets into that into the tower. And our teammates are not doing so hot though. I think our vein is dying a little bit too much. Follow my blade. Top turn has spawned. Okay, he used his ult. Drop a word here. Grab the honey fruit. Follow my blade. Back some fury. Into battle. 
Ooh, there's a lot of stuff happening here. Okay, we managed to get a free kill on the thing. Oh, we end up dying to the ignite from yeah, ignite from the fizz. Unfortunately, we didn't have an ultimate on time. See. Okay, we're kind of catching up in kills. Still down three kills though. We do have the Blade of Rune King now, so trading against the fizz will become a lot easier. Oh, unlucky that we quit there. We lost the cannon. Cannon's not really that important in Wild Rift though. It doesn't really give you that much gold compared to just a regular minion. That was pretty good, we got 2 kills and we didn't even have to use our ultimate. Alright, let's try to get some damage on this tower while the Fizz is dead. Yeah, we're starting to do a lot of damage to the towers, we might be able to just get it here. Oh, the fist misses. Oh. Okay. We don't really have any, like, big buy. So I guess we'll just stay here. We didn't have the ult. Uh, the fist didn't have his ulted. I think he was trying to jump to the honey fruit, but he just missed. So we end up getting a free kill on him. Okay, we do have enough for the static shift. I'm gonna go back and buy that right now. I get this up as well, so we can fight for that if we want. I'm just gonna try to grab mid and then probably go top and just split. We don't have our ultimate, so can't really be uh, too aggressive against their burst damage As carry. You wish. Okay, we do have the rift summon here. Pretty good. We should be able to get the tower. Unlucky we didn't have an ultimate. I think the uh, Seraphine ulted us there. Mm. Okay. I mean, we created a lot of pressure, so our top laner gets uh, tower. And we got the Rift Hero charge on that hit tower as well. Alright. Let's grab the QSS because they do have a lot of CC. Looks like my team got the Vayne here. Very nice. Follow my Alright, let's go back mid. I want to split push, but there's too much action going on top, so if I group top lane, I'm pretty much forcing my team into a fight. I guess I'll just stay mid for now. Let's see if I can take some of their jungles. Wow, that was a really long chase. Everything was really annoying there. Jesus. Yeah, we can try to get this dragon. Oh, 
Oh, the Vayne tried to contest, but we got the dragon anyways. Nice try, Vayne. Ooh, my team wants to attack Baron. Okay. Got three free buff here. I don't have my ultimate, so hopefully, uh. They don't fight yet. Ooh, okay. We have to try to kite there because without our ultimate, um, we're actually just gonna get bursted down and die for permission free. No. Luckily, we had a Braum in the front line. He was able to pretty much tank all the damage for us. Okay, let's try to get the tower here. They have four people dead. We're very close to our Infinity Edge as well, so definitely wanna back for that. Whenever possible. Okay, we have our infinity edge. Well, let's take this big wave first. Alright, we should be really strong at the moment. There we go. And... I guess we can go Into for a battle. another crit item. <laughs> that will pretty much propel us to like a hundred percent crit chance. Okay, we got the triple. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna save our QSS for the Seraphine ulti. Yeah, we have to save the QSS for the her ulti, otherwise uh, we won't be able to move. Oh, <laughs> she hurts. I need some lifesteal, maybe I'll go top lane. This is actually a very good situation for us to just split push now. Because we're so strong, nobody can 1v1 us. Although team fighting isn't too bad for us too, because we have a Mumu. As you wish. Just gonna go for tower here. Jax is dying though. Oh, okay. We didn't press a Q in time and we didn't have our ultimate. It's a pretty hard fight though. Every time Seraphine ults us, we just have to use our QSS. Um, I think it's better to just go for a magic with this item here. Yeah, let's... We could go for... This thing. No, we don't have mana. That's pretty useless. Oh, they end up throwing there. Okay, great. <laughs> we didn't have to get the Nexus ourselves. I guess they felt like they didn't have a chance to win. <laughs> Which is true. Oh, there you go. That's how you pretty much want to play Trindamir. This game is more of a uh, mid lane Trindamir than a top lane, but you can split push, you can team fight. Trindamir is really good at both as long as you get the uh, QSS. And let's see what we get. We got three medals MVP, triple kill, and visionary. I guess that's gonna be the tournament gameplay. Like I said, if you like the video, make sure you give a thumbs up for the YouTube algorithm. Really appreciate it. I'll see you guys all next time. Bye.